three tracks available in Locust Fork, Alabama, five acres, a 16 acre, and a 43 acre track. Hey everyone, it's Chad Kemp, your Alabama land agent. And you've probably already watched the other two videos on the five acres and the 16 acres. And this is the video on the 43 acre track that we have available in Locust Fork. Now, in the description below, you're gonna find links to those properties, to the 43, the 16, as well as the five acre. And there's gonna be some links that's gonna pop up in this video that will take you to uh, the 16 acre video, as well as the five acre video. Now the pricing for this 43 acres is down below in the comments. If you have any questions, be sure to write a comment or a question, or better yet, give me a call. My number is gonna be in the video as well. Again, always we appreciate you watching and enjoy this video. This property is located in Locust Fork, Alabama. This is one of three properties available. We've got other videos broadcasting the other two tracks. The one in green is the 16 acres and the other light orange is the five acres. And we do have a video for each one of these properties, but this property is just 42 minutes to Birmingham. You just hop and skip to Aniana and you're only about an hour and a half to Huntsville, Alabama, and two and a half hours to Atlanta, Georgia, and again, about two hours to Chattanooga, Tennessee. Now this, again, this is County Road 13, as you may have seen in all the other videos, and again, it's accessible between Highway 79, as well as 160. 160 takes you to, from Hayden, there at the interstate, all the way to Cleveland, Alabama, which is just north of Locust Fort. And again, Highway 79 takes you from Birmingham to Cleveland as well. And you come through Locust Fork, and this is where you come to the property. But as you turn off of Canterbury 13, you'll turn on to kind of cross over the road, and then you'll kind of go by that side street sign there on to Buck Road. Seen the other video, 16 acres is on Buck Road as well. Uh, it actually fronts Tabernacle and the road for a few Buck Road with the 16 acres. This is the 43 acres we're talking about, and it's just a beautiful place. It could be mul multiple homes, multiple homes. You could come in here and, and give each of your kids or friends or go in together and have plenty of space. There's easily a home site here another home site there and then beyond this pond you see these pine trees beyond that that field back there there's another two two home sites that would give everybody enough room and space to have their own mini farm if you wanted to but you have a two two tenths of an acre pond here uh, farm pond and it's it's right in the middle it's between that back field and this front field here as you come in you come in the front field um, you've got a lot of usable pasture areas or hay fields if you want to do that. That green part of the property there that had been um, bush hog, that, that's part of the property as well. But it's just a really neat property. It lays really well. It's a place that you could easily turn um, kids loose on once you had some of the fencing down. If you weren't going to use it as a farm, you turn them loose and they could easily ride forwarders. You don't have to worry them, worrying about them going down a hill or off of a cliff. Um, again, if you like to have your property featured, we do list properties and that's what we do. And we can help you as well. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And again, we appreciate each and every one of you that watch my videos to um, for following me all these years. And I do appreciate that. But we're gonna have a barn walk through here. It's got a barn on this property. And the barn's closer to Tabernacle Road. Um, where the five acre house is that you may have saw in some of the other videos, but just a great opportunity if you're looking for a place to make a farm. This is probably one of the best out there. It's priced really at a great price of 215,000 for the 43 acres. And you can click, click the link above for that 16 acres we were talking about too. If you don't want 43 acres, maybe you just want to have a home site. And also you can, um, click this link coming up on the five acres too as it pops up here shortly but this is the area off of tabernacle road for this part of the 43 acres 
So um, you can go down Buck Road, get to where we just were, where the pond is, and this actually part right in this here fronts Tabernacle Road, and this is that barn. Now the barn, now this barn's in, I would say in pretty decent shape. It does have some roof uh, damage on the back end. You're gonna see that when we walk in because obviously it's gonna be more lit. It's gonna be more uh, visual. Like you can see that from the lighting standpoint, but it's about a 40 by 60. On this side, they have a chute um, where they would run um, cattle through to actually work them in, in the farm part of it. So, you know, treating them or loading them, you, they could easily load them through that area as well. But still needs, barn needs a little bit of roof repair. And this farm needs a little bit more love. I mean, there's a lot of privet hedges that needs to be cleaned back. The barn, around the barn needs to be cleaned up. The property entirely needs to be cleaned up even more so, you know. But it's got a great start because we just had the farm bush hogged enough that we could come in here. You can see the roof and opening there in the back, but that's what I was talking about. For the most part, it's fully enclosed. I mean, it's it's a barn. It's a farm barn. You know, it's it's been around. So, you know, but it has you know, a great start and a great opportunity to come in here and actually use it um, and enjoy it. But this would be a great place to have a homestead, make, you know, live off the land, sustainable living. We always, people always talk about, we talk about living off the land. This gives you that ability to be able to do that here and, and have enjoyment and turn your kids loose or your or just for yourself to have fun. But but give me a call. I'll be happy to show this property. Also, be sure to comment below if you have any questions. Again, as always, I appreciate each and every one of you for watching and following me all these years, and that means a lot. And um, if I can help you, please reach out um, to me. But this is a great spot. This is a great property. It's one of these properties. It's priced right. Uh, that's the little shoot area we were talking about. Again, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, reach out to me. Again, always thank you very much.